Fallout Season 1 is available on Prime Video. I am doing my review. It will have different spoilers in it because I'm going to talk about everything that I've seen. So make sure you go check it out before you finish this. Now, my initial thoughts now that I finished Episode 8 was this was good. It's not the best thing that I've seen this year, but it was very good. I played the game before, but I'm not big into the game. So I'm just basing it on what I'm seeing. I don't know if they didn't switch characters. I don't know if they got the black guy supposed to be the white guy. I'm sure if I knew these things, it would have changed my perception of Fallout, right? But I don't know if they did any of that. I'm just basing it on what I seen. It didn't seem like it was woke to me. I was able to watch it and not feel like uh, another one of these woke series. Here we go again. Of course, the standouts to me got to be the goal. He was phenomenal. I mean, that character was great. Uh, Maximus and Lucy, all three of them did a great job. And they had Lucy, you know, she was a, a woman that's out trying to figure out the truth. I love how they portrayed her character. I love how they portrayed Maximus because this guy is a person that's not really supposed to be in a position that he's in. But he ended up getting in a position he was able to wear the armor and be Knight Titus, which I loved his storyline. How he came up and he had to battle guys and fight guys and he was great in the suit. And when he was outside the suit, you know, he really had to show courage in order to defeat people and, um, you know, continue to get better and better. And then, of course, he ends up falling for Lucy. She falls for him. You know, he tells her his story, right, because he's a person that survived in an area where nobody survived. And he was saved by the Brotherhood. And I loved that whole uh, dynamic of it, right? So they had the Brotherhood. Then they had these people that's the vault dwellers who just stayed in the vault, the rich people, which they get to um, live comfortably in the vault. And we learn about how that came about, right? With Lucy's father and how evil he was and how evil the the vault dwellers really are you know so you get to learn all of these dynamics and coming from a person that didn't know any of this i thought it was well written i thought um the action scenes was great learning about this whole world was uh great to me right because this was stuff that i didn't know and I was able to get all the concepts without doing no research. Without I was just able to understand everything that was going on. So I thought they did a phenomenal job. Like I said, this ain't the best thing that I've seen. But if I was rating season one out of seven stars, I'm going to have to give this a 6.1. And that, that might seem high. but I think this was was pretty good. You know, it was an enjoyable watch, at least for me. I know some people, you know, might find things to nitpick and, you know, the CGI and all of this. But for me, you know, just sitting watching it, knowing nothing about this world, I love learning about these characters, and I thought it was a good watch. But if you've seen it, let me know what you thought about it. As always, if this is your first time here, make sure you sub to the channel, check out the other content. Y'all be easy. Be safe. Peace.